And for the wrestling build, another idea I came up with is I'm going to convert the Texas wrestler to a stampede. So hopefully y'all enjoy. Because if I do that, that's going to be better than the wrestler because it's going to have more ground clearance. But the mile per hour is going to be a little different, but I really don't care. I mean, it's going to be worth it, guys. Let me just tell you that. Because it's going to be stampede and the wrestler compiled. So that means it's going to be a rust peed, a rusty peed. Hehe. <laughs> yeah, guys. Hopefully, y'all enjoy. Bye, guys. I'm thinking about doing that crazy idea I came up with the Traxxas Rustler, even though I'm going to have to build the twin engine mount, but then I can buy the dual ESC mount. And then on top of that, I'm going to use the Rustler and buy me a team associated DR10. Then. I'm going to use haul the Traxxas Rustler and DR10 with the Axial ICX-102 with the trailer hitch and a custom trailer. So yeah, it's going to be insane guys. And then, it's going to be well worth it guys because it's going to be well worth it. That's for sure because I'm going to plan this out like I want to. So, got DR10 and Traxxas Rustler. And then, I think I should be good. Let me check the dimensions. So then I can tell you guys. Seventeen and a half inches long. 17 and a half inches long, 12.25 inches wide for the, that's for the Traxxas Rustler. And then for the drag car, then for the drag car, for the drag car, the specs are 24 inches long. 10.71 inches wide So yeah, so that means it's gonna need to be So let me think this through hmm. So trailer is gonna have to be Minimum 41 and a half inches, 41 and a half inches, and then, then 12 and a half inches wide. So, 41 and a half inches long by 12 and a half inches wide. So, that's how wide of a trailer and long of a trailer I'm going to need. So, yeah, guys, hopefully, y'all enjoy. Bye guys, see y'all in the next upload.